The following program contains strong language, sexual situations, and alcohol abuse. So, if you're easily offended, you may wish to consider listening to anything but Slater's podcast. Viewer discretion advised. Everything I say is not serious all the time. Rick, are we recording? <laughs> That's usually how I always start them. But Rick's not here today. You know why, folks? Because I am recording Shawcast in the comfort of my own living room. And it's so comfortable until my guest came in. And uh, that guest... That guest is is my sister again. Well, She's back, too, baby. She is back, back again. So Ooh. much so that we're gonna that she even up. had a song. Back again. Stephanie's back. Tell the sun. Guess who's back? 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 Guess round two, baby. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. Wow, Listen. your phone has really low volume. Listen, That's as high as it goes. It's a refurbished iPhone from Walmart because I shape the minds of children. All right. And I'm poor. That's good. Well, also, for, for those of you who are maybe just uh, listening, I'll describe the scene because uh, those who are watching may notice I'm in a robe. You know, you because I'm, I'm home and I'm comfortable, and she wanted to take shots at like 11 a.m. But it's um, now almost. But it's but it's now almost three, which is my internal eleven a.m. Okay, I'm a I'm a late riser. You are, and You're, I'm the opposite. Yeah, we, we, we can tell ourselves. by the energy already. But for those who are not watching, just so you know, we have um a guest in between us. Two. Why don't you say Why don't you say hello? We have Grogu, and I love Grogu so much. I named my cat after her, Grogu, and this is her friend or. Grogu's friend, Hermy the Spermy. Yes. Our two extra guests. Yeah. So, so a, ba- a baby with sperm on its face. It's really kid friendly. <laughs> it's a good thing that Grogu only eats frogs and not Hermes the Spermies. Mm, yeah. Okay. That's good. I like that. No, <laughs> he's not a sperm. Sperm. He's not, he's not a swallower. Sperm kind of look. Uh, Spitters are quitters. Okay. Or he's we a get, quitter all right. This is not your podcast, bitch. Um, Listen, we're giving the pe- I'm gonna make you famous. This is gonna go viral. Oh, it's you. It's you doing it's, the Lord's I'm work. making you a star. Okay. A star is born today. All right. And it's not you. It's me. That's great. I'm gonna make you. Okay, that sounded threatening, and now I'm scared, and I'm still hung up on the sperm thing because I feel like we mentioned frog, <laughs> and I feel like sperm look like tadpoles. Because they are, aren't they? No, what? Like you no, think we're harvesting I'm... frogs in our ovaries? No, but like when you give birth like, to a baby, it's actually a frog, and are... then they take it into that weird nursing room where they have to spank it in case it didn't cry, is... and then that's when they turn it into is a it... lovely prince because a male nurse kissed them. Yes, there are male nurses. You ever see Meet the Fockers? Oh, I that is a good, it is good, good. movie. It is Doctor good. Doctor F- Fokker. It's a circle of trust. Circle of trust. And you're out of it. I, no. Yeah, you are. Why? Because I just made it so. Mm-mm. Yeah, it's like the bad luck spot. Oh, in Washington Park, when yeah. we went on our gangster and ghost tours, we can shout out Rose. Good- <laughs> shout out Rose, our oh, fucking tour guide, dude. She was fantastic. I would want to kill myself if I she- had to lead tours of twenty plus people in a group on the streets of New York City on the weekend. This I- bitch was on like tour number two or three, probably. And then she had two. She more. had two more after. She was great though. I was I like, mean, well, how much I, cocaine? I feel. Do you have? I feel her pain. I really do because it's like. When I go on field trips with kids, it's stressful. You have to count. Well, yeah, and plus you have a chaperone everywhere you go, right? Yes. I just, <laughs> I wish. That's I, why Grogu's here, by the way. He it's her support Grogu. service Grogu. It is. And I, I really do need a chaperone when I go out because shout out to my friends, Amy, her husband. You're already on a mic. I, you I don't know. have to oh. do this. Oh, oops, sorry. Well, um, if it feels natural, do it. It does. Okay. So, Shout out again, shout outs to Amy and her husband Jordan, Alyssa and her fiance Zach, Jade and her husband Jim, and Alexis and her husband Kirk, and Megan and Isaiah. Because when we all go out, I have to have a chef. Is Megan and Isaiah not an item? 
No, they are. Are they oh, married? No, they are dating. They well, just bought a house. Well, because you give a prefix to every single person. <gasps> Megan, on there. I'm so sorry. No, no, but she. <laughs> no, you go. I'm back. You go, a her bit. husband, her boyfriend, her this, her that. I like that though. It was very feminist of you. Her Instead boyfriend. of being like Jack and his wife Cheryl. Jill. Yeah. Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill. They pushed themselves down that hill. That was a murder suicide. It was. Yeah. Oh, before I forget, what we're oh, drinking we, today? Can I introduce? Them? Can you get take a breath, take a beat? <laughs> I I bought it, bitch. I want. I know. Okay, you want to hold it too. Yeah, it's like I'll your other like Vanna baby. White. Van, wait, oh, Vanna sorry. White, I, the only good job that pays a lot to only have to use one arm, besides maybe prostitutes. <laughs> so this is the. It's hot. Grogu's hiding it. Oh, Show it more. It's the eight one eight Kendall Jenner tequila because I'm not <sighs> above keeping up with the Kardashians. What are your thoughts? Um, on the Kardashians. Kardashians? Oh, God. I, You know what? Honestly. I don't like them, but I respect what? them. It's yeah. like a Tom Brady thing. You I, know? I say that all the time. Don't like, but I get it. I get what they're doing. Don't hate the play or hate the game. Smart moves were made. The devil they capitalized on those titties. Doggy style has never been more <laughs> fruitful in this nation's history. <laughs> no, honestly, I was just telling you before we got on the air that... Um, the devil works hard, but Chris Jenner works harder. Yeah, no, I that's why they it, both though. they both wear Prada. It's true. I respect it. You know, I can never put my sex tape out there. Just kidding. I really don't have one. Steph has. Uh, oh yeah, the, did I say it was you on here? I just said Steph's back. I didn't even say who you are. It's okay. People already know who it's I am. It's my sister, even though she was adopted. There no. we go. We're oh, all excuse caught up. you. You were adopted. We're I was born first. Speak. No, I remember. Remember when we used to tell Brittany and I used to tell you. That you were adopted because your birthday is in June. And Brittany and I, our birthdays are in March. So we always used to have ha ours inside. Oh, speaking of birthdays, I think this is why we are birthday monsters. Because besides... Birthday monsters? Yeah. Like, I'm, a, I'm a monster for birthdays. Or like a slut, if you will, for birthdays. Because birthday mom... Birthday slut. Birthday slut. <laughs> because mom and dad, besides Christmas... Our birthdays were a big deal. Remember, we well, Christmas—that's have... Jesus's birthday. They say, uh, "Yeah, if you believe in the invisible sky." Daddy. Oh yeah, I forgot you're recovering Catholic. Recover. So are you? We're recovering. I'm Catholics. not recovered. I never recovered from that. I probably never will. That shit was <laughs> fucked up. I like so many wasted Sundays on 45 minute mass. I'll tell you what. Yeah, sitting, I, standing, kneeling, kneeling standing, thing. sitting, kneeling, I mean, standing. I was going to say lot. something, but I won't. Yeah, yeah, you get on your knees, but not to pray. <laughs> yeah, we not understand. To pray. Yeah, we get it. We, you know. It's okay. You're a whore. Continue. It's hey, listen. There's no shame in my game. Hey, but, I I, I am well, not actually, a slut shamer. You know what? I on okay. Well, listen. I would be, but I haven't been touched by a man or a woman. Touched by an angel. Remember and, that show? Oh my gosh! Mom used to make us watch, watch it. it. Yeah. Now you just want to be touched by a man. <laughs> I just want woman, the heavenly anything. touch of a, a big no burly man's. What is your type? Uh, like the like you. the bounty paper towel <laughs> brawly lumberjack or are we uh, we more the Kleenex uh little humble nerdy cold bitch. Well, I'll tell you what my type okay. isn't. It's not someone who's mentally ill. Not Scott. Yeah. <laughs> not Scott. Oh, yeah, because that's the other toilet paper brand. Oh, my. I just yeah, got that. Yeah. Well, I, I like, actually didn't even mean that, but here well, we are. Well, like Dad said, I'm smart, just not PhD smart. Shout out to Dad. And he wonders why we have complexes. Sorry, I got to get Because he's the king of the back backhanded compliment but i will tell you what my type isn't anymore it's not mentally ill men oh that's what and you were that's what you were seeking originally i kind of fell into that like because i'm a fixer i kind of fell into this white padded room and saw a cutie pie <laughs> I and was did. like hey was like, do hey, you want to get out of here yeah because we can't <laughs> we can't but no someone who's not mentally ill and or a recovering alcoholic so okay yeah that's not my type anymore i'm trying to change that's that where that was your ways. type those people need people there's someone I, for everyone they say not me. and what about those I, people I, huh? used to, I used to be a fixer but i'm not a fixer anymore mm. i'm not fixing any more messes so yeah I'm, she's over that home improvement i am you Just hear that me, who was that guy in home, tim characters um tim allen no, like he was the character, like the home improvement. Yeah, Tim Allen. Oh, it, he, he went was... by his real name in the oh, show? Oh, no, no. That'd be fucking weird. I'm, or Bob the Builder. I'm no more like <laughs> Bob the Builder, DIY. Fix your own so, man. So sorry, folks. If you're named Bob. We apologize. You got to you gotta identify as Bill if you want a chance with Steph. Yeah. That's basically what we're yeah, saying. Just, so who's your type now? Um, 
Uh, I don't know. I just I <laughs> just a breathing just, man uh, again. Who's someone who's specimen stable and you know can handle me because in the words of you, I'm a lot. Which you're definitely not a little. Yeah. I'm just a lot. Well, I mean, I'm I'm a little physically now because I lost seventy five pounds. So yeah, far. if Rick were here, the sound war will be like woo, 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 woo with bow, with the clapping. Bow, 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 bow. Yeah, okay, maybe not the bam bam bam, but yeah. definitely a clap. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. That's actually really cool. That's the first time I almost knocked something over. Whoops. It's, right. it's only getting it worse. But no, I've lost 75 pounds since the new year. I am so excited. So yeah, like little me. I'm little teeny teeny eeny teeny. Little me. Little who's afraid? Little Steph on the prairie. Me. You should be. She's gonna be my new social media manager. I will. I you told me earlier today. Yeah, I was still waking up. Yeah, but you... No, you're good at it. You just... You you know what's crazy, though, that what? you probably should stop doing on, on a real note? Posting stuff while you're actually there live. Oh, just if you in got case some, they get abducted? If you got some stalkers, I don't know. Then they're like, oh, shit, that's where she is today. Oh, she's at this bar over here. I'm going to go there and pretend to run into her. Amy and then you're fucking the in time. the trunk, dude. I'm not kidding. I don't know. I, I usually wait at least an hour because of all my, all my stalkers. But no, if I ever got abducted, uh, that's a great. my personality alone, my personality alone would scare them off. Yeah, yeah, they would kick you out for sure. Yeah. <laughs> That's the truest story They would be ever like, fuck told. it, I don't even want to kidnap her anymore. I'm actually I'm also going to kill myself. Yeah. Yeah, it's it rough. Would. Well, I watch enough true crime. I would know how to get away with it. Yeah, I have a whole show come out, and it's just called Me. Me. <laughs> Instead of you. Me. And you're just talking. You don't have to lean in that much. Okay. Yeah, you're like fucking making out with it. These were listen. donated by the Troy Bond Foundation, okay? Uh, listen, I, again, it's been a Treat dry them with respect. <laughs> uh, well, it'll give me more incentive to mess with it really, really close. So what is your, uh, a lot of people are obsessed with true crime, and I actually don't get many guests that like to or talk about it. Oh, my gosh. No, because. the right person. Well, no, not that they, like, are fucking forbidden and have an NDA against, like, Netflix or something. But they, I don't really get into it because I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I get the allure, I suppose, but I'm not like a huge true crime. Well, have, you listen to podcasts. You, you, you listen to the podcasts. You fucking watch the shows. You like the movies. I you're do. all about the stalking, killing, kidnapping, all the words, other words I can't say on this because I'll probably get banned one day on when YouTube. I'm canceled. But, um, but um, I love, okay, I'll do one more shout out. Um, my favorite. <laughs> my fa- <laughs> shout out to a killer? If that is that what no, you're going to do right no. now? No, listen. She's like, I just well, want to say hi to Ted Bundy like, from the I grave. Say, I go to his grave every Sunday with flowers. Well, you know that Ted. Oh, Ted Bundy is my favorite serial killer. That was him back from the dead just yeah. now with the shot clock. Jesus. He's like, that's right, Stephanie. Say everything I told you about when I had you tied up in my basement. Where did he go to kill people? He traveled. <laughs> so first so he took you on a scenic route in Portland, Oregon. Oregon. Okay. Actually, it's from Shawcast to the Ted Bundy. Like Okay. Like well, I can't us. I can't have more than two minutes of, of killer talk, honestly. Because uh, he oh, we should do We had to take the shot. Shot cheers. first. And it's disgust this is literally I had to shove oatmeal down my throat before this. After I had a coffee because I woke up at twelve like a That's respectable earliest, human being. The earliest you've ever woken up up and as of late possibly um but i had to do that and coat my stomach for this fucking gross ass kendall juice <laughs> it's all her sweat and tears and probably <laughs> pussy juice in that tequila 818 that's what that stands for 818 818 germs no, from the- kendall's pussy <laughs> that's what this is it's the, of course it's, it's blanco because she doesn't want to get it twisted <laughs> oh my god okay Cheers. i'm gonna really hate this so Me much too. oh God, you too? Me. You were no. You no, did I do this. Love You're the, I don't. Not at fucking Gin eleven a.m. Motherfucker. <laughs> Ooh, I can feel my hangover. Oh, I didn't even finish this. Oh my god. <laughs> I did one of those things where it like comes back up as you you're taking the shot, oh. and then you gotta swallow it again. So that counts as two uh, shots for me. Um, oh my gosh. Oh. That is rough. I'm trying oh. not to vomit. Oh, that. 
Ooh, thank oh. God it tastes bad. Because if it tasted good, I would so have a which, lot of problems. 818, probably. Which uh, which alcohol <laughs> do you like better, the whiskey or the tequila? I like how you put a thumb in front of it, like mom with Facebook. <laughs> you like the Facebook or the Instagram? Which one do you want? I can't see, see your that, story. That, and she does the apostrophe S, because she'll do like Walmarts. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't know and if that's what's a city the, thing with her. What's the day of the week thing that they do? Like grandma and mom, it's like uh, they say it weird. It's not even an accent; they just say it weird. Like yeah. instead of like, like Tuesday, they'll be like Tuesday, or oh, fuck, I can't I, do. It. I'm not doing it right. Sunday, Sunday instead of Sunday. So, I don't know. I don't. I'm fucking of, hammered already. Speaking of mom, I don't know the days of the week. Honestly, every day is Friday for me. I can teach you one of the songs that I uh, sing to my students. For the days of the week? Yeah. There's yeah, let it rip. Okay. Fuck it. So it's like the Adams family. Um, and it goes like this. The the theme song. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. Adams. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. Days of the week. I'm putting my thumbs closer so they can hear my sound. No, it they, 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 they picks up the sound. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week. Yeah, we got. I got it. I, I thought you're just gonna run it back again. That's so um, cute. I guess it's cute. I love incorporating spooky. I like that they, yeah, that they used a popular. Uh, oh my gosh! Could you do it again? Oh my gosh! Could you imagine? Oh gosh! No. I'm gonna feel no. so hungover. Yeah, no, no, no. We don't have to do it again. That was an alarm for something else. That was to post on Instagram so I could get oh. 20 likes and feel really good about it. Why myself. do you have to get 20 likes? It was a wow. Now you're harping on it. It was a joke. Oh. No one likes my shit. Uh, no, no, I they like do. all they of your do. stuff. I'm your, I know I'm your you stand. do. You are the first person to like everything. I am. From, but not I'm just, your number one fan. But not just me. Everybody. Like, my friends are always like, oh, Steph, yeah, she they commented, like she liked it, she shared it. Like, everybody, but, like, live. Like, how are you the first for everything that gets posted across every app from all of my friends and myself? I'm type A, and I like being the first. Because if, like Ricky Bobby says, if you're not first, you're last. Yeah. I, also, people, you've definitely seen this before. You know how, like, people will comment on stuff and be like, first, like, first oh, comment. Yeah, first comment. Or what is that? I... The, do I, the kindergartners you teach know what that trend is? No, Why is that a thing? Ask, ask. Like, is it just being like, haha, like, I saw it first? Like, I don't. Maybe. Yeah, like, no, 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 I saw it first. Yeah, but like, what is that? That's weird. I don't, I don't know. Maybe they want some clout. Maybe. Clout to, for being a freaking loser? Maybe. First? Oh, I don't get it. Maybe. I mean, back in the day, being uh, your first was embarrassing, was it not? Wait, like, first. Like, how'd you, yeah, how'd you lose your, um, Oh gosh, virginity! Wow. Well, don't go Boys into don't so go, go into graphic detail. I'm still a lady. Yeah. Oh god. Okay. So I was 17. I was a senior, so I was late to the party. Yeah. And um, so it was. It wasn't Will Ferrell. So like everyone uh, thinks wait, that it yeah, was. Wait. Yeah. Bra- pull pull the brakes on that real quick yeah. because Will Ferrell. She's not talking about the real no. one. Okay. She's talking about one she dated whose parents obviously hated him when he was born and named him Will when their last name was Ferrell. Well, he so was why the eighties? Like why? The late 80s, Will like Ferrell me. was large and in charge <laughs> since his day of birth. Okay. Like there's no there's no way they didn't know who Will Ferrell was when they well, named their child. Well, he was child. born in the mid '80s, like a couple years before me. So I don't I don't know, but um, it wasn't Will Ferrell like people think that it is. Um, it's not the I know. And no. then what was that? I remember him back in the Disney. Oh, Nick, I'm telling you, he looked like an emo version of James. No, Lafferty not from Nick. Montreal. Why are we yeah. talking about Nick? Now? No, he was the one that like I lost my V card to. What? Yeah, that was him. It wasn't Ethan after the dry humping incident. It wasn't. Oh, uh, we're <laughs> not talking about the dry humping of 08 again. We're not doing it. <laughs> Trust me. He Nick. Oh, you're pulling up his profile. Yeah, he doesn't. Wow, look, we're getting into this. It's yeah. He doesn't look as good as I'm sure he looked great back then. <laughs> yeah, no, he looked like he looked like um, Nick. If, if did he have she, tattoos? Yes. When we were like fucking five, how old was yes. he? We were seventeen when we met. 
So, on the edge of 17 and on the edge of coming inside of you. Did you guys do, use protection? Yes. Okay. Sure you did. Most that was a delayed time. yes, which means, yeah, we found Tupperware in the kitchen and thought that would do. <laughs> I Basically. fucked her with, but no, I fucked people, her with a when, rectangle. When we dated, he looked like the emo version of James Lafferty. For those of you who are at One Tree Hill stands like us. One Tree Hill was the epitome of my adolescence. Yeah. He looked like an emo version of James Lafferty who played Nathan Scott. If Pull him up was, on Facebook. I want to see But he doesn't him. look anything like he does now. He looks terrible. Okay, but I, I'm sure if I see the facial structure, it'll kick back some memory for me. And yeah. I'll be like, oh, that kid. All right. I'm trying to do the least disgusting picture of him now. He doesn't look disgusting. I mean, I don't he think wasn't he looks as disgusting. hot as he was when we were younger. I feel like I don't, I'm looking at the eyes. Oh, wow. Look at that model shoot. Yeah. I'm looking Aww. at the eyes. If that was like a newborn photo shoot or for like an adult man. Why did yeah. he post that and make it a profile photo for that many years? That's sad. I don't know. I watched he him didn't, he grow didn't look, up. He didn't look like that when we were dating. I'm sure. So. They all were hot when we fucked him for the first time. Yeah. I mean, yeah, but it was just, I mean. Where was it? At his cousin's house at a party, so it wasn't... Ed, there were other people there? No, not, not in front of them. Yeah, like, you, it was, you guys all go outside to the bonfire, yeah. do it, do it. No, do it was at his cousin's house, and there was a party, and I don't... It's so... Cause like, and then everyone left, and you stay behind? No, we... You're like, my taxi was, left. There were no Ubers. You fucking rollerbladed home through the was, woods. <laughs> No. Or you ordered a taxi. It was early 2007 before my 18th birthday. And it was at his cousin's house. His cousin was having a party. And nothing like, like a cousin party, am I right? <laughs> yeah. That, well, it is upstate New York that we grew up in. I know. The people but, know this, okay? But uh, I don't know. It wasn't. I don't. I wouldn't say it was love I, as much as raging hormones. I don't hormones, think anyone loves the first person they have sex but with. But I knew that I cared about I him and trusted him enough. To let him, I feel like everyone's well, most people's first times because then I look, I look at you. You fucked at a cousin party. You pro- the cousins were probably fucking each other. It was actually an incest festival, and you just got invited <laughs> well, by the state. He is from uh, Fort Edward originally. Okay, so it, yeah, it, we're it really tracks. blowing up this dude's tra- spot. Sorry, his name's <laughs> Rick. Tra- we're gonna say, wait, no, we can't use Rick. Uh, right dick. Right? Yeah, there we go. Dick was your first dick. <laughs> um. He doesn't. F- you like, guys had it. Said, was it in a basement in a bed on the I floor? Just, Are you a floor fucker? Floor. <laughs> this is shocking. What surface were you getting your virginity <laughs> taken off of? It was a hardwood floor. A hardwood and floor. To make it even worse, um, at least it wasn't cement. <laughs> that could be. It could be. <laughs> you could be in an unfinished basement. To make it even worse. Um, Nickelback was in the background playing. I love Nickelback. That's the video I, I just mean, posted. Does it, it, can it say, get, it gives early aughts, early aughts energy, upstate New York energy. And yeah, that was, didn't What he, song was playing? Do you remember? Far Away. Oh, that's right. You were just saying this the other yeah, night. I forgot. Yeah, far Away. Wow, see, so that's now, why I kind of like not remembering because then it's like the first time every time, uh, you know? But I do remember my first time. Be like, Wasn't it with Nate? Uh, yeah. Where, wow. You told me. Yeah, but there's not that many Nates. There's a lot of Nicks in the world, but a Nate, that's specific. You don't have to say the last name. Yeah, but Nate's specific, so people at home isn't, watching my show. Isn't that... Um, but it's fine. No, everyone everyone who needs to know does know. Isn't that Justin's cousin? Or Justin, brother? Brother, yeah. Well, what? let's not name the whole family okay, now. I now won't. now we're narrowing it down. Now people it's okay. t- are taking out their yearbooks, looking we'll at family out. trees, and knowing that I fucked that kid. But did you have music playing in the background? We did not have music playing. Oh nope. my! Not on your first time. Nope. And it was on a futon. But, well, that's a step above hard one. Yeah, 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 yeah. With yeah. Nickelback you know playing what? in the that's, background. Yeah, that's pretty funny. I think sur- the surface that you lost your virginity on tells a lot Says, about a person. So what does it so say about a hardwood floor? You're a hardwood floor. It's the first so thing in splinters you get, ass. you get dirty easily, but all it takes is one little mopping, and you're right back where you were, you know? Yeah. You bounce back quick. You're reliable. So, You've been a lo- around a long time. Yeah. Futon. Futon. It's to go. That's a to go order, you know. You're not staying. You're not making a reservation. That thing, you could. It could be a couch. It could be a bed. It's very flexible. Did, did I think that 
That's yeah. good. And then Britney's was in her bed of marriage. In her bed of marriage. She's the mother <laughs> Which Teresa. explains that you are you're God's rewarded. child. You're, you're re- God's you're favorite. You're rewarded because she waited, unlike No, us. because then you don't know what you're sex rewar- is. You're rewarded because she married a ball player. She's set for life. I know. She's good. She's fine. But, like, the no, trade-off I, is. Yeah, you have to. Because could you imagine? What if really oh bad my, in bed? And then no, that was, me with, with, that was me with stage five clinger. He, oh, now we're doing code names. That's John, fine. No, no, John no we his, don't have to say <laughs> the I would, be, I would be so Please bad at stop out. I would people. be so bad at the witness protection program. Oh my god! Mafia. Oh my god! I would be no, terrible. because you and cops don't like you. You you get along too well. Like, uh, what do you mean? How do you mean? A cop will pass by and be like, "Hi, officer. I smoked a <laughs> blunt when I was twelve years old, and I didn't really mean so, that. I'm so sorry." My friend, you know Amy and Jordan. Um, Jordan just became a police officer. Shout out Jordan. Yeah, and that's Amy. so. I'm so sorry for you, Jordan. He, I know he. I'm he'll, so sorry. He would tell you, "Oh, I know." Yeah, because she's going to give you a list of crimes, and then when she thinks she sees a crime, she'll give you that list, and it's mm-hmm. not even a crime. I know, I do. It's just someone standing outside smoking <laughs> a cigarette, but to Steph, that was the next fucking Jeffrey Dahmer yeah. way to fucking get in I, there. I do annoy him with, like, questions yeah. uh, that I have, or um, I What have questions have you asked him that Just your he, basic, like, traffic laws, or... What's the most interesting answer he's given you on a question you've asked um, that you he, didn't know? So I usually text him first, and he texts back. I didn't ask how the question and, was no, asked. No, he says, no, he always. Let me paint the picture. See, this is the problem. It's too Long much detail. Long story short, all my friends back home, take a sip. Long story short. No, my friends always make this um, game. They made this game up. Alyssa and Jade. Hi, I shouted you out. Oh, I love my them. God. Um, so... Um, every time I say long story short, so that's three times now. Oh, wow. And, um, we have to take a drink of whatever, whatever I hope, you have in your I hand. I hope the place that you're at has fucking 1830 racks because you say that yeah, all I do. It's my trademark. The They'll time. have it on my tombstone. So long story short, when, here lies Stephanie <laughs> Harrison, 1989 to 2024. 24. Long story short. But uh, that is a good tombstone, actually. It is. Um, and I would still be talking in my casket. Actually, I want to be cremated. Yeah, I think they actually the the coroner, well, who's the who what's the name of the people who like put makeup on corpses and stuff? Like the makeup artist? Yeah, but I a mortician. Thank you, Ooh, Troy. That came from that, the grave. That was a uh, Troy Bond. And they who... fucked my face up. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, and well, oh, the people so, who do that need to sew your mouth shut. Was the do. point I was making? They do. But it continue because like, you're gonna anyway. Oh yeah. So back to Jordan. So anytime I text him with a question, he goes, "I." He'll be like, "I'm on patrol." Like I don't know if he's really not, really is or not at the time, but I just. What yeah, does that mean? Like when he's patrol like on duty, but he has told me, he's like, I swear to God, I can't help you if you're in legal trouble. He's like, yeah. Well, get back to my freaking question. You what? a-hole. I feel like Oprah right now. I got to keep you on track. You're going to start jumping <laughs> on Barbara, the stool. Baba, Baba. Um, what is the most oh, interesting trophy. fact he's given you in an answer to a question you asked him? Um. Well, recently my apartment building sold. To oh my god! He's, <laughs> it's the start of a novel every time. Just give me a quick bit. So I was just asking about how that all works out because I had to sign something that I didn't quite understand because I'm not PhD smart. Okay. So <laughs> the bell got it right. Oh done. gosh! Oh my! Oh this. Okay. So, um, so he gave me the answer. And I was like crying, freaking out because I thought I was going to be homeless, but everything worked out. And he goes, "All it has to do is legal paperwork." You know, and he goes, it's all a process. That was the most interesting answer of yeah, cop intelligence that, that you me. had to share. Yeah, was I mean, landlord I, shit? Yeah. I, oh, oh Well, dad and I went to I was like, Fed I was a waiting. couple of weeks ago, and we were, too, um, we were too intoxicated to drive home, so I was asking um, if uh, dad could oh leave his car. Oh, my. You could never. We just went on a gangster ghost tour yesterday, like we mentioned previously, I believe. But whatever, we did it yesterday, and she thinks. <laughs> Wait, was it because I had to that, go poop real bad? No. The oh tour? my. Oh my god. Way to bury the lead. Oh, yeah. Um. No. Well, I'll get to that story in a second. But we went on this tour, and and then you know she's into the true crime mafia, all that stuff, and you you. 
Think you could be in a, in a mafia or a mob? Oh, or? absolutely not. Yeah, they would kill you in five seconds. They, they would. would Adriana you in season oh, one. Oh, The Sopranos. All right. The Sopranos. Oh, it's such a good show. It is such a good show. And we love it. We got to take this shot. Number four, my friends back at home. Number four? We're yeah. on number two. I thought I did four long story. I can't. Listen, oh, Matt no, no. Matt. I'm saying shots. I'm saying shots. shots. All right, we got to take this shot. Okay. But what are we cheersing to? Um, long story shorts. And Boom. I gotta plug my nose because I'm a pussy. Uh, I regret this. <sighs> Not the podcast, just the tequila. Thank you for specifying. Uh, I was worried it was me. Oh my god! <sighs> you know, what sometimes when you drink, like you were talking, I'm earlier, sweating, and I'm in a very plush, velvety robe. What material is this? Like. Velvet? I don't know, but it's really hot. It's velvet made out it's of. It's so the comfortable, one. but it's so hot. Oh, I might have to I'm change. Oh. I might change at one point. Oh, oh god, I got gosh. a back drip of tequila. Uh. Is that possible? Oh my gosh, I don't like that. So bad. So on our uh, Ghosts and Gangsters tour, if you're yes. in New York City, go check it out. It's actually pretty. And dope. ask for Rose as your tour guide. She was phenomenal. She was really cool. I enjoyed her a lot. She had, she had cool pants. She did. Yeah. I really and liked a cool her. personality. I, yeah. I, I might add. Um, but she led us around all of Little Italy and all this Chinatown. Cool s- yeah, Chinatown, all this cool shit. But you know where I want to go to, honestly. But hang on. Oh, okay. Because I want to tell the story. Okay. You know the story. Oh yeah. Go ahead. I have no shame, so I, I know you don't. I'm gonna tell it anyway. Me. Even if you had shame, I would blast this yeah, on a my, megaphone. The, the shame. Ship sailed long ago. The same ship has left the harbor, everybody, it okay? It has. Lighthouses beware. It has. Because um, it's Stephanie's sailboat of shame. I'm going to sink you in a second. <laughs> like so, the Titanic. Uh, shut up! <laughs> Don't tell me to shut up. So, We're gonna yesterday. Fight, 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 fight. Jerry, Jerry. Are you done? Yes. I'm putting this mic back because you're fucking loud. Okay. So yesterday we go on. Oh my God. I wouldn't. Are are you so happy? I wouldn't want to listen to this because I would be like, I can't hear them. They're just yelling at each other. I mean, she's so happy that I'm leaving to go back home tomorrow. Oh my to god! Yeah, you count, you count down the days till you visit. I count down until you leave. <laughs> you leave to that's the how, second. That's how it works. Oh. Um, okay, so we go on this tour that she sent me, by the way, a couple weeks ago. Because when she comes down to visit, she lets me know and counts down like it's fucking Christmas. I do, and I'm I am Jesus. So thank you. That's a compliment. <laughs> and she comes down. She sent me this tour. I get tickets to the tour. We go to the tour yesterday. About. Maybe 30 minutes into it. Uh, an hour? Possibly. Yeah, an hour, yeah. An hour possibly into this two hour tour, which I will say, side note, a little too long for yeah, a walking no, tour. I agree. Yeah, I agree. But halfway through, there's a rest stop because we're children on a field trip at this point. And I, I understand her struggle. And she. As a fellow educator. Is that all? Can I continue? Yes. She goes into the bathroom. I go in there with her because she made me come with her because we're five years old and she wants me to fucking hold her hand and wipe her ass. Shut up. (laughs) So she goes in there. There's other people from the tour in this bathroom. Clearly it's all of us in there from the tour using the toilets. And Steph's in the middle stall. Why'd you pick a middle if you knew you were going to shit yourself? Pick a side. Pick a handicap. You're disabled at this point. No. Yes, they were. No. So yes. anyway, okay. So all these people are in the bathroom that we're also on this tour with. She goes in there, blows it up like a terrorist, blowing it up. I get out of there because I don't want them to think it's me. So I peed real quick, wash my hands, unlike her, and I left. I do wash my hands. You don't. I smell that. Yes, it do. smelled like poo. Oh. Smell like poo. poo, poo. I love- Steph hands really smell like poo. poo, poo. They did. It was not roses. Lies like a rug. Okay. Well, at least I have a rug, you floor fucker. (laughs) Hardwood floor, actually. Hardwood floor fucker is even worse. (laughs) If the floor is harder than the dick, you got a problem. Okay, so, everyone's sex when you first have sex isn't that great. Yeah, no, it honest, not, it's not, no one's ever raving about the first time they had sex ever. If you are, then that's probably the only time you had sex, and I feel sorry for you. So anyway, I got 99 problems, but a hard dick ain't one. 
Come on. She's making t-shirts, everybody. She's quitting her day job, and she is going to make t-shirts. And it's just all going to be the ones in Chinatown we saw that just say, fuck you, you fucking fuck. fuck. That's my she really vibe. liked. She really liked that one. Um, so we're in the bathroom. She's blowing things up. Like blah, Melissa blah, McCarthy. Blah. It's yeah. coming out like lava. Yeah, she's fucking, she's, yeah, she's bridesmaid. Uh, bridesmaids blowing up. It Coming was, like it was embarrassing for me. I had secondhand embarrassment and then you're in there. Then she's texting me <laughs> while I'm outside. Sweating and pooping. Amy laughed at that because they sent her the screenshots. Yeah. So I'm outside waiting because I want people to know I wasn't the one, you know, blowing things up. And so then... She texts me while she's on the toilet. It's like, oh, I'm so embarrassed. I am. I mean, I don't it get was. embarrassed. It was. I don't get bashful about most stuff, but pooping in public, I do. You were in the bathroom. I was in the bathroom. And so then yeah. you came out. I let you know when the coast was clear. Then we go outside. We're listening to the tour. We have like a couple more minutes before we go to our next stop. And Steph looks at me and is like, oh, I'm going to throw up. And I'm like, there's a garbage can right over there. Chills. It was either going to come out my mouth or my booty hole. And I chose my booty hole. I, I'm actually impressed that you get to choose. <laughs> I, I don't. It's just what my body wants. So you were like, hey, body, my I'm going to transfer these files downtown. And I'm going to poop it out again. Because you didn't get it all out the first time because you were embarrassed. You were holding back. Yes, then I you went back up there. Was there anyone in there? No. So you could just free fall. And then, yeah, free uh, fall and free. R.I.P. Tom Patty. Now I'm free, free falling. Fallin'. All right, good. So then the only problem with that is the rest stop time was over. So the, the, the tour of 20 plus people in our guide continue on. And Steph's still in this bathroom on the second floor I of was. this fucking bakery. You're it was baking just- your own fucking baker's <laughs> dozen up there. But, yeah. And then my we're poo walking, ice cream. We're walking down. I'm like, dude. Poo-poo. I'm like, what do I do in this situation? The tour is leaving, but she can't no, leave. No, and I was a good older sister, and I said, I will show the screenshots to your listeners. I said, I don't want you to miss it. Go on without me. I know that. I wasn't going to paint you in a bad light. So then... <laughs> I text her. I'm like, what do you want me to do? She's like, just go. I don't want you to miss it. Blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, okay, well, I'll let you know the next stop we're up and just like meet us there when you're done doing your, your business. Blowing up the bathroom. At yeah. Ferrara's. Yeah. It was and, Ferrara's. Uh, that, that Ferrara's bakery has been around since like 18 1892. And then mob, the and mobsters would meet there. Yeah. And uh, 1892. And, and then it blew up in 2024. So you can't go there anymore because Stephanie no, is I ruined a it. I ruined it shit storm. All right. So, Literally and figuratively. It, they got that. They picked that up. Um, well, so anyway, I'm going on the tour. Like she's me. asking, stop talking over me. I'm going <laughs> to no. kill you. So then I wouldn't be doing my job if I wasn't driving you crazy. Go ahead. Go, go, go. You don't want to fill the air. I don't like awkward silence. It's not awkward. I've known you my whole life. Unfortunately Rogu's for you. Rogu's here. Pet him when you want to okay. talk. All right. There you go. I'll be there you go. Good you doggy. know, we're going to use this as a talking pillow. Okay. And like, like every time s- you hold like it. Like I do in school. You need one. Holy shit. How have your kids not plotted your murder? How have I not seen you on a Netflix series of making of the murderer? Oh. Fuck our teacher. <laughs> She's dead. How I went from kindergarten to a full-grown <laughs> a adult in. in jail. <laughs> so, whatever. She meets us up back at the tour, but all the people are there, and our freaking tour guide is being a good tour guide, and she's, like, counting all the people. She's like, we have someone missing. Where's Hocus Pocus? Because Steph obviously was wearing a Hocus Pocus sweatshirt. A spooky wo- basic but she was she was Hocus puking out of her ass, and... I'm like, oh, no, she's fine. It's my sister. She's back at the last place in the bathroom. Like, we, we, we got after her last night. We're hungover. She's throwing that was up. a good cover story. Yeah, yeah. Because, yeah, you. see, so I'm also, I was also doing you well. And uh, whatever. She met, met up with us at, the, at a, the next stop and finished the tour like a champion. And but the, that's a weird situation I never thought I would be in in my life. Like, I know. It was like when... Um, I told you like the story of uh, with Grandma and Grandpa Harrison's timeshare in um, Adesto Beach, and they went to South Carolina, or not? Well, they were in South. Oh my gosh, those shots are hitting me already. They went to Charleston, and they went on a horse and buggy tour that I went on with Michelle when her and our cousin Michelle and Ethan were. This is this is when you add details <laughs> that aren't necessary. Um, Charleston's a great city. Um, but so they were on their tour, and Uncle Mark. 
Marky had to go to the bathroom. Shout out to Uncle Marky. And um, he had to go to the bathroom really bad, like how I did. And he couldn't hold it. So he peed his pants in the middle of the tour. And Uncle Matt goes, oh my, like, was like, you. Well, peeing, I'd R. rather, R. if I couldn't get to a bathroom and I had to go really bad, I'd rather have to pee than poo. They have pictures up. We should call Uncle Mark and ask because I think they have a picture. We should call him on the podcast. A picture? Yeah, because uh, grandma or grandpa like took a picture of Uncle Matt and Uncle Mark. When he couldn't hold it anymore. Of the pee in his pants? Yeah. Like, I swear to God, because, yeah, because it was a whole thing. And Well, I would imagine it'd be a whole thing. Because Uncle Matt goes, oh, you're being dramatic. You really don't have to go to the bathroom. And he goes, no, I really do. And he, When was this? This was, God, I want to say, like, close to 10 years ago. And then I think Uncle oh, Marky. Okay. I literally was like thinking maybe they were like younger, but they were full no, blown forty something so year old men. So must on the Harrison side of the family on dad's side. Of the I family. went to bed till I was twelve. Oh, we know. Yeah, no, remember. they don't know. I you re- know. I remember the smells. I remember dad. The yeah. smells. I mean, you used to hide the pull ups underneath your pork chop. Yeah, is that your pork up? chop comforter bed. And dad would get it from underneath the bed. It'd be like, look at this. Look at this. Why wouldn't you tell us? And you were crying. And yeah, so that's much trauma. So much shit. trauma. Why did we... I do that? Probably because dad was fucking scary when we yeah, were younger. He was so scary that I had to hide my pee. Peed in pull-up diapers under my bed because oh, I dad. didn't want him to see it in the garbage and know that I peed yeah. because I well, was like, way, I'm, I'm trying to were... not pee my bed. And if he sees a dirty one, then he knows that I did it and I failed. Yeah, either way you were screwed. Oh, my like... God. But then I got crafty with it and I would put them in a bag and then throw it out the window. <laughs> Really? I don't remember yeah. that. In the snow. Because <laughs> the snow was so high. Yeah. I was like, oh, I don't hide them under my bed so there's no smell and he won't find them. And I'll put it in then a little plastic the- bag, a dirty one, and then I'll open the window from my two-story bedroom, throw it into the bank of snow, and then I'll go outside later to play and I'll put it in the dumpster. Is that what you did when the snow melted? Did mom and dad No, because then sometimes the snow melted and I missed some. And then they would come out like spring fresh air. And dad was <laughs> like, piss. what the fuck is in our backyard? And I was like, just my dad puts nothing to oh see. My gosh. You know what? Honestly, poor dad. That's, no. Did fuck be, him. He made no. me feel like that. That bad that I went to that extremes as a 10 year old uh, and then all the way up to 12. And then one day I just stopped peeing. Could you you imagine? I haven't peed peed since 2002. Could you imagine being the father of three girls and the three of us? I feel I feel bad. Who the fuck cares? He's the one who put it in mom. (laughs) You know what you were doing. I know. I'm sure it was more than three times. Well, obviously, because if Dad hadn't gotten that surgery, the little snip, 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 there would have been the more vasectomy, of vasectomy. We oh, can say that. Yeah, if he. Oh my gosh. Oh you my said God. everything else, but we don't want to say vasectomy. vasectomy. We can't say the well, V word. I think I think saying snip, snip, snip sounds cooler. Sounds funnier. Snip, snap, snip, snap, snip, snap, snip. You know how oh many toes three vasectomies take on a man? I remember when I used to snip, snip, snip my bangs. <laughs> You don't still? No, I did during COVID when everything was shut down. And it was Oh terrible. my God. You were cutting your bangs way before COVID. Well, you, obviously. You fucking, if, if COVID is, is the time marker of when you started like cutting your bangs, then it would be fucking 2001. Yeah, no, but I definitely was cutting my bangs. Why do people COVID. get bangs? This is actually a sad story. So <laughs> it's oh, no girl gets bangs because they're happy. So what happened? There is always a sad, sad no, no, no. story I, or a traumatic event that led you to just across your forehead. So were the 1980s a tragic event? Because mom Nin- got bangs in the 80s. The 80s was a DIY bang fucking story. What do you mean? That's exactly what that was. That whole 80s can be summed up to love, bangs uh, and head banging. I mean, I shit. was born in the 80s and I. 89. It still counts. You're not an 80s baby. You're 89. It still counts. No, that's okay. So if a 1999 kid today who's 25 years old these days said, I'm a 90s kid. I'd be like, yeah, no, you make a good point. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Take this shot, bitch. Okay, to the (laughs) 80s and to the bangs because they're not a happy story. Bang, bang. I'll tell you in a minute. Bang, bang. God. (laughs) I can't even, can you finish the rest? No, I'm not taking yours. Oh my God. Oh. You pick this. 
I didn't want Kendall Jenner in my living room. Yeah, uh, I can't even finish the rest. Sip on it. Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna just put this to the side of the. I kind of feel. I kind of feel good drinking in a robe. Because you, you feel fancy. Spill, you, spill. you feel like Ron Burgundy when he goes, I have something to tell you. You have a breathtaking hiney. No, I feel like Ron Burgundy when he says, Oh, I'm San a, Diego. I'm a, no, are you going to let me say it? No. Cool, then I won't. <laughs> no, and you'll never it. know, and the people say will never it, know. And it, guess what? It. Just remember, Stephanie robbed you of that gold that no, was about to come me, out of my tell mouth. Tell me, I want to hear the gold. No, because we're good as gold. You're no, you're we're pirate gold. gold. Okay, you're Gina fake, Shea. you're fool's gold. Bitch, I'm gonna make you famous. Oh my uh, god! So if you're if kid? you're the reason that brings me to the spotlight, I will just step out of you it. You will be dead to me. I will live like ever. Hi, bye, and I'll fucking peace out. You told me I should be your social media publicist. Yeah, I say a lot of things. I know, but I good as gold. Hashtag Vanderpump. Okay, I gotta finish the rest of this. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Yeah, you don't drink. Uh, so so don't. Steph lost a lot of weight. How much how many pounds? 75. 75. 75 so I pounds. Still have, hold on, I have to do the math. Okay, why don't you do it silently <laughs> okay, while I give some that. background? So Oh, Steph's, I got it now. Okay. Wow. <laughs> go ahead. I can't have a moment. Jesus no. Christ. No, go ahead. No, it's fine. No, you can no, take it. Take it. It's yours. <laughs> now you have it, you don't know what to do with it. Isn't that funny how that works? <laughs> Four, I have 45 pounds left because I wasn't always fat. I was always beautiful, but I said to the invisible st- sky daddy, sky daddy, S- invisible sky daddy. I, I don't believe in God. No, that's I've just never heard you say that. That's really funny. I mean, I'm not an atheist, but I believe in I'm like Stevie, which is Stevie, which Jesus Stevie Nicks is. <laughs> my, God ooh, damn it. That was Excuse a seven. Me. That was seven the devil the coming out of me. Saying, <sighs> Um, but I, I'm not an atheist. I believe in the paranormal. I believe in mother nature. I believe in, well, I don't think anyone doesn't believe in mother nature. That'd be kind of weird. Yeah. I believe in like science. (laughs) What's this rain outside? (laughs) Definitely not mother nature. Fuck all that weird witchcraft. (laughs) Like what the fuck? I believe so. Like I believe in just like magic and I believe in. I believe in a thing called love. I believe in a thing called love. But I... So you prayed to the invisible sky daddy. I said, invisible sky daddy, if you can make me hot again like I was, I will be... When was that? I was <laughs> always just <laughs> a bitch. You're wisely, beautiful. Your words. You're beautiful. It's, it's true. It's true. I oh, saw your, your face, face and then you crying. got those bangs and I oh, realized I don't want to be with you. <laughs> oh shit. We got to go back to the bang story. <laughs> okay. Hang on. Here's the order. Cause now we're getting drunk. <laughs> so here's the order. Oh yeah. I got to finish this. sky. S- finish your shot. Talk about sky daddy's fat prayer and then oh, so ring I it said- and then roll it back on the bangs. All right. Okay. One, two, so, three. So, oh, I got to finish it. God damn it. Yeah. I don't drink that much anymore. That's why I can't. You're the one who begged me to come on. I know. You reap what you sow. That's something I found out in church all those years. Uh, Chase it quicker. Uh, why are you just letting it sit in your mouth hole? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, wow. We're a family uh, full of swallowers, people. Uh, that's God. good. Not me. Spitters are quitters. Yeah, that's what and I I'm just. And I'm a quitter. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I heard semen's good for I'm a gosh teeth. darn failure and I'll admit it. Semen's good for your teeth, I heard, but. Oh my God, <laughs> no. You know who That's fucking says teeth. that shit? That's why no, my teeth dude. Are white. There is some, <laughs> there is some weird ass little male scientist dude, probably with like a twirly mustache in his little lab coat. He really didn't even pass, he just knew people and he fucking became this expert, quote unquote. <laughs> And he's like, hey, yeah, uh, I'm the sperm guy, and I'm going to tell you how much good sperm does to the female folk or the male, whatever you're into. But at this time, it was probably female. I'm into both. And he's just like, hey, out there with you me. realize sperm's actually really good for you. If they swallow it, they get 10 more years on their life. <laughs> their skin is way more useful. You can also just put it right on their face. I don't know why it's a scientist from Minnetonka, but here we are. And, That's and then you could also from. make sure it makes your teeth more white. You know what I mean? White on white. That makes sense, does it not? That's why my teeth are pearly. I'm just kidding. Oh my! Again, Lord. I'm. A, I don't I'm believe a spitter, that. Though, so I'm a quitter. 
We both had a one-way conversation with each other. That was that <laughs> was fun. That. All right, let's get it back was. to uh, duo lingo. Duo uh, lingo. Avocado from Mexico. All right, well, that's going to get cut. So, <laughs> no, <it's not>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. It's your, it's your life. <laughs> it was fun. Don't cut out the fun stuff. It's Avocado not, from stop. Mexico. Stop. Uh, you're giving the mic stand a, a hand job. It's making me uncomfortable. Again, in it's front been 13 of, months. In so front please. of your... Okay. Cover All right. size, please. Let's go back to the threes. <laughs> Let's go back. I'm your teacher now. I am the teacher <laughs> now. Let's go back to the threes. Yes. One was to finish the shot. Did she I do did. it? She did. Good uh, for you. Barely. Two. Two was to finish the Sky Daddy fat prayer. Oh, so I said Sky Daddy. Getting Catholic for a second. Recovering Catholic. Get on your knees Catholic. and pray, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> That's a new rap song <laughs> coming straight for you from, uh, nope, not Switchfoot. It's a uh, Switch Cube. <laughs> and I said, Invisible Sky Daddy, if I can please, I don't know why I'm closing my eyes, please make me skinny again. I promise I won't fuck it up. Please, and I will use, please, please, please don't make me skinny. For, oh, I love Sabrina Carpenter. But me too. Anyway, she's hot. She's good. And she and builds things. Hot. Builds what? She's a carpenter. <laughs> that was a <laughs> dad joke. Bum, bum, bum. But I promise I'll appreciate it more. Because remember in high school when we, like most girls, including myself, thought that we were fat. And then we look back and we go, we weren't fat. That's we weren't we- that fat. <laughs> we weren't that fat. Jerry, Jerry. <laughs> But no, I just, I, I, you know, I'm in the peak. Thank God I didn't peak in high school because I. Ah, uh, Sam, I'm, I'm still waiting for mine. Oh, shut I'm up. I'm climbing that away. mountain. Malky you rocking high. Mounty rocking high. I meant were, to say rocking mountain. <laughs> I love this John is Denver. strong. You were more popular than me. You and Brittany both. I was uh, the punk rock. I wasn't that popular. Really? No, yes, you were. No, I was one of the mids. You know, I was like the limbo. I, then I must have been low, low, low at the bottom pole. No, I was limbo popular. Britt was popular, popular, and you were definitely not at all. Yeah, you got that right. That's okay, because at least But I you were popular eat. within your friend group. Yeah, Because no, they were scared. I was, but. She no, wore a lot of goth it, things and stunning Avril belts. Levine. And black makeup. <sighs> And my yeah. Spongebob PG that mom and dad She needed. was a skater group. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> but no, I didn't you tell me that you were you weren't nervous because when we were and I like you were in ninth, Brittany was you were a freshman, Brittany was a junior and I was a senior. And didn't you say to me you weren't nervous because you knew that like I would Yeah, I was like I get cool book points from Britt right, and, and I then, get fucking bully points from Steph because if anyone fuck with me, Steph would be like, I didn't what? Give and they'd be like, So sorry about it. So sorry. No, because I remember that I forget who it was now because it was so like twenty years ago, but I remember um I'm hugging my Stanley for emotional support. But and you can grab him, him and hold but him. But I remember that um there was some bitch talking about you because I had to make up a gym class and there was someone talking shit about you. And I because said, Because of how fast I ran that mile. Because yeah. <laughs> few times I've been that was that cool. Track and it's not just going to happen like that because I ain't no hollaback girl. I ain't no hollaback girl. B A N A N A S. I'm shit sweating. It's bananas. I am sweating. But no, so I remember some of my bio. Because I remember someone was talking shit about you. So I remember in the next locker, Happened all the time. So I remember. One million times. One million times. I hmm, I love Austin Powers. But um, I remember I said, if you're going to talk shit about Slater, you're going to talk to me. So I had you and Brittany covered. Everyone, like, yeah, what, did. what did people think about me in school? Because I don't remember. It was such such a long time ago. I burped. I can't look at you seriously right Why? now. Because you're holding Grogu and there's for, fucking jizz the- all over his face. Well, he won't eat it because Grogu only eats frogs. I know. He won't eat the sperm. I wouldn't want him to eat the sperm. They're friends. Because he's, not, you know, a, he's like the, not a quitter. He's not you, a spitter of the quitter. Okay, we got that 18 times already. We understand. You swallow. All so right, for boys? Any, so for All everyone, right? So Guys, if you just don't care and you want to hear someone talk for 90 minutes straight without you getting a word in and she also swallows, this your girl. 
this so, girl right here. Just so for everyone oh, that this isn't. This is fuck Tinder. I'll start being your dating advocate. I Okay, tail first is weird. Swim, sperm don't swim backwards. They don't. Oh, does sperm do the breaststroke? Yeah, they do. Right up to fucking Pleasure Town. Oh. That's actually weird. I never thought of a sperm going this way. What if Maybe we got that's it how wrong? I was conceived. It's not I like know. they have eyes. No, they don't have eyes. So, like, what if they're really but going this way? How do they know, way? though? Like, not are they, like, a Stevie Wonder? That way. Isn't she lovely? Where the fuck Isn't am she? I going? <laughs> Trying to find <laughs> an egg. But it's just more just of my permits. For anyone who was not a millennial in Gen X before we had the phones to light up a crowd, we had... A lighter. Isn't she lovely? Yeah, yeah. Isn't she well, lovely? Well, if you look. <laughs> Isn't she comfortable? <laughs> I never thought in my whole life I'd find me a wife that would just swallow every night. Da -da 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 -da. All right, we're fucking done with that. Jesus Christ. I hope dad doesn't listen to this. Probably not. Oh, God. Well, he probably would before mom. Well, we have to call mom because she's going to start bitching about, he didn't oh, call me on the Oh, my podcast. God. Okay, well, we only have like four minutes of battery, so you better hurry up. Okay, we got to call Anastasia. Last call for refreshments, folks. Go right this second to get something good to eat and drink to enjoy now or during the rest of the show. Okay. Hello. Hello. Hello there. Mama from the Bronx. <laughs> Hello there. Is it me you are looking for? All right, we don't have time. The battery is going to die on the camera. So, but I know that you wanted to say hello. It's our mom from the Bronx. Guess what? I joined you guys like a half hour ago. I said screw it. I don't know when they're going to call me, but I'm going to have a screwball. Ooh, at three forty-five on a Sunday. Sunday That's fun right. day. What? What? All right, shh. Let mother speak. No. Mom, I'm so doing my help, my devil horns right now. One and the youngest one, the baby. Your bookmarks. No. You're degenerate kids, because you have Mother Teresa in the middle. It's going how it sounds. <laughs> Hashtag right, sisters. Girls. Mom. Mom. Come on. Do you feel like when we were little? Look at, I got Madonna in the background. You guys oh. went to go see her without me. You didn't think of your mother, did you? <laughs> I think about you all the time. <laughs> Remember that one? Did she play that one? Wait, the, which the one? The two-second like thing you showed? <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't, hear I didn't it. get it. We didn't hear you it. didn't hear it? No. no. Can, can you, you just... Hear that one? No. Can you just tell us what it is? We can't hear it's, it. Uh, Madonna. I got to tell you, I got a really cool notebook today, too, because you know what I'm going to do? <laughs> Mom is you know how many shots I got in my phone? I got a zillion, right? Well, guess what? It's going to be all fucking therapeutic to write my shit down in this little notebook. I said, I'm going to get a cool notebook. <laughs> and this is the point where I just had to cut it off because the camera died and my mom was just riffing about five other random topics. So uh, consider this a save. Thank you guys for listening. And feel free to subscribe on YouTube where you can watch all of these episodes. Um, the channel is at Slater Harrison Comedy. No spaces, no underscores. Just straight up that. Thanks for listening. And Stephanie will not be back. <laughs>